Florida residents, no strangers to the summer heat, but now our average summer temperatures are climbing. Meteorologist Daniel Giuliano is here with a look at how our heating trend has increased over the past 52 years. Danielle? That's right, Joy. And Florida is known for its hot summer days while people flock to the sandy shores. And for many new residents, this may be their first summer in the Sunshine State. The first day of meteorological summer started June 1st, and it's safe to say that the Florida summer heat is coming back in full force. On average, the temperature for the month of June in Jacksonville sits around 89.9 degrees. And just last week, we saw two days above average in the 90s. Over the past 52 years, we've seen an increase of about 12 days above normal over the entire summer, with our average summer temperature increasing by about one degree. Now, that doesn't sound like too much, but with many days in the 90s ahead of us, especially if we look forward to this week across the southeast in total, it's important that we talk about heat safety. That is a big one moving forward. You want to make sure you drink plenty of water, Find shade when you're outside, wear lightweight and light color clothing, clothing, and reduce strenuous activities outdoors, especially during peak afternoon hours. It's also important to remember that Florida isn't the only state seeing an increase in temperatures. In fact, the most significant changes have been across the southwestern United States, with Reno, Nevada, increasing its average summer temperature by 10.9 degrees. Now I'm going to bring Chief Meteorologist John Gaughan into this conversation because, John, the heat also impacts us in the summer in terms of these strong thunderstorms that start to pop up like we're seeing right now. And you can hear the rumbles here at the station, probably many locations in Duval County. Danielle, absolutely. Look, the heat lingers more now than it did in the past. So now we do get those build up thunderstorms that used to fade and be like one and done pattern. Instead, now we get the rumblers to go for hours and hours.